the term agnostic was created to avoid the term atheism. The term agnostic was not created by Charles Darwin himself, but it was coined by Thomas Henry Huxley, Darwin's close friend and a fierce defender of his evolutionary theory. Huxley introduced the term in 1869 to describe his own philosophical stance regarding knowledge of the divine or metaphysical. He wanted a term that reflected skepticism about the ability to truly know anything about the ultimate nature of existence, especially concerning God or the supernatural. Huxley explained that agnosticism was meant to describe someone who neither claims to know nor denies the possibility of knowing the truth about such ultimate questions. He contrasted this with the Gnostic tradition, which assumes certain knowledge about divine truths. While Darwin himself was reticent about discussing religion or his personal beliefs, his theory of natural selection undoubtedly provoked widespread theological debate. Some have speculated that Huxley's development of agnosticism was partly a response to the societal pressures and religious critiques Darwin faced. The term provided a way to discuss belief and skepticism without outright rejecting or affirming religious doctrines, which suited the intellectual climate of the time. Darwin, for his part, often referred to himself as an agnostic in later years, particularly in private letters, though he avoided public controversy on the matter. His reluctance to explicitly state his stance reflected his preference for focusing on scientific discussions rather than becoming entangled in theological debates.